GRTV News, I'm Jennifer and I'll be bringing you the top stories from the world of gaming. First up, Ninja Gaiden 2 is coming to PlayStation 3. Tecmo are bringing the former Xbox 360 exclusive Ninja Gaiden 2 to PlayStation 3. Renamed Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2, it will not just be a straight port as it will contain several new elements such as iron being playable, new boss fights and weapons. Resident Evil 5 has quickly become one of Capcom's biggest success stories ever. The Japanese publisher shipped a massive 4 million copies of the game to shops around the world on day one. And the games have taken first place on sales charts most everywhere. Sony have announced that there are now an impressive 1,000 songs available for purchase at SingStore that launched alongside SingStar on PlayStation 3. Some other statistics from SingStore. A total of 4 million songs have been downloaded through the service. More than 100,000 homemade videos have been uploaded and these have been viewed more than 9.3 million times. Now that's impressive. The Behemoth have shown off the first trailer from the third game and it looks like an innovative 2D platforming experience with lots of examples of the Behemoth's brilliant and unique design and co-op elements. No platforms have been announced at this time, and the game doesn't even have an official name yet, but we can't wait to learn more about this game. Things changed quickly in the gaming industry. In January of last year, THQ purchased Maryland-based developer Big Huge Games, best known for their strategy games Rise of Nations and Rise of Legends. Now, they have been given notice that if a new owner has not been found in 60 days, they will close down the studio. Hopefully Big Huge Games can find a new home before then as we are intrigued to find out more about their RPG project headed by former Oblivion game designer Ken Ralston. The studio is also working on an unannounced Wii project.